Hello, hello. This is Tanya, Tanya Martinez here with you live again, all the way from the Sunshine State of Florida. I had a, my first live video yesterday. I was talking about things about personal things. And today I am going to continue a small video so you get to know some of the hobbies that I am involved with. It, it, um, besides music, it relaxes me. I like gardening. Oh, hold on, there's a bee. I gotta remove myself of the bee because I have a lot of flowers. Anyhow, this is short. I wanted to talk to you with, uh, to a specific plant. Hi, look at the butterfly. Can you see the butterfly behind me? Yeah, I planted a couple of plants, specifically plants that attracts butterflies. Um, my mom, she passed three years ago, uh, April of this year, three years ago, and she was uh, a fan and a collector of butterflies. So I keep her legacy going. <laughs> and every time I see a butterfly, I salute her because she said that every time I see a butterfly, that's her lingering around. Anyway, going back to one of my hobbies, I guess wanted to talk to you about the aloe vera. Have you heard of that? Do you know anything about it? Why do I want to talk about that specific plant? Because it's a succulent plant, a cactus, that has a lot of nutritional value. And I am going to switch the camera for a sec. Okay. I only have two because I don't need more. I might do more, but remember, I am not a farmer. <laughs> so I, I only have two. This one was given to me by a dear friend, Geraldine. And this, look how beautiful this. It's a cactus. They have more than 250 species of these and although it's perennial and it, ne it needs full sun or at least mainly full sun this one that you see here i transplanted back here uh, so it got a little bit dry because it was constantly under sun and water and it gets bad so what i did i transplanted here and look i have a new baby now so this plan, let me tell you, please stick with me because this is something that you can do at home or buy it. Now with the coronavirus, they're selling a lot of aloe vera juice and because of the nutritional value. And let me tell you, one of the nutritional values is it cleans your digestive enzymes. It uh, is an anti-inflammatory and it eliminates your free radicals. And it also boosts your immune system. So now that mainly the people who get sick or pass away is because their immune system is compromised. So this is a natural way of intaking uh, an immune system booster. So you can dilute that with your juice, with a frappe, uh, anything that you drink and I'm telling you, it will help you with your immune system. If you're not into that, you can buy it. But I am trying to suggest the more natural way is better. I wanna wave here, a couple people are joining me. Hello, Azaz, how are you? Please type in what country are you, are you watching from? One of the things I wanted to tell you is that the aloe vera even though it's wild in the climate, tropical climates like here in Miami, it's actually a plant that comes from the Arabian Peninsula. Do you guys know that? I did not know that. You know how I learned? Because I did some research and after my mom passed, uh, both of my parents passed out of a heart attack. So, oof, but there's a bee around. So I decided to get into more health and wellness one of the other things that I do that's why I'm sharing details about personal details about me and I have a blog 
and if you care to join just to educate yourself because the more you know about health things or organic things a longer life you will have and healthier life let's go back to aloe vera anybody else joining hi how are you stick around so yeah this plant it's it's coming from the Arabia Peninsula and another thing that uh, it provides it's good for your health it gives shine and for your skin for example if you have burns you put a little bit under it and uh, it releases the heartburn let me show you how this plant is it's 90 percent water if I cut a little bit you see it has a little gel that gel is an, the latex is good for anti-inflammatory okay so you you peel off the skin and just eat the, the gel inside guys this is a medicinal plant and it's an Asian plant use Asian people in the in the Asian era we did not have a pharmacy it were people that used to invent apocotherapy uh, things that will put things together plants to heal to heal people it's also good for your gums if you have inflammated of gums you put it around your gums and it, it lowers the, the inflammation of your gums the taste is not the best but you can mix it up with sugar if you want to or any flavor um, but I highly recommend it and that's those are the, my two aloe vera plants what else oh if you ingest this uh, carefully you want to look it up and you want to make sure you don't have any allergic reaction no that you shouldn't because it's natural but some people have special dietary needs um, it also has uh, anti-inflammator inflammation properties it uh, helps you with your joints yeah with your joints muscle joints it has many other health benefits but I just wanted to share that with you because as you can tell I'm involved one of my passions is natural health organic health and I have my blog if you want to know more about it uh, it's at Tanya's health and wellness it's under my page or at Tanya's fuse you don't need to buy anything it's just information free information for you I wrote a little bit of everything like the onions what are the onions good for uh, different things okay so aloe vera is one of them kombucha tea what is it good for stuff like that okay so this like I said it's just a quick short video shooting you so you can get to know more of me what I like to do besides posting business things <laughs> and health is the number one because without good health there's nothing you can do this will boost your immune system aloe vera we have it around if you cannot find it go to the supermarket carefully or plant it like me look let me show you again that's my aloe vera I have two plants all right and I rescue the second one because it was dying and now it's growing green again all right guys so that was it tomorrow I'll come up with something else but if you do have a question regarding more of the properties aloe vera shoot me a text and I'll send you the link of my my health uh, blog so you can just read it and, and educate yourself guys remember knowledge is power got it and your health matters take care of your health and your family I shall see you soon and don't forget to like this video all right God bless and be safe bye